you're finding yourself coming into that age that you get involved so that your needs, your health care won't be taken away. I need to be a key voice and a strong voice for seniors and senior issues. And it's my honor to do that, but I also know that there's a lot of work that comes with that. That's why it's important for me to engage with the senior community, to hear what their concerns are, and more importantly, in that building, in the Capitol, to really fight for funding for programs that help seniors. We're going to all go down this road, and I need you to make sure all the I's are dotted and the T's across when you get there so that we won't have to have these rallies like this, crying out, fight, fight, fight. Well, we're really hoping people will take the materials and the information that they learn here and go and visit their elected representatives in their offices in their districts and continue to press the case for better funding for aging senior uh, and senior supports and services and for legislation that provides the programs and policies that will make sure that all of us can live with dignity and as independently as possible as we age. It's in these times that we need to act together and we need to stand together. And today I am with you today to stand with you in whatever it is we need to do.